How's it going everybody? It is your lovable little lion man CJ here back with another game for y'all. Um, I was planning on GTA 5, but I'm not feeling too hot today. Um, and then I was thinking League, but I'm definitely not good enough for that to be recording that for y'all. So I was thinking something light, like maybe Spore, and I don't know, I miss my guys. So let's, let's see how they're doing. Um, I, I might have missed I'm not doing Freddy's right now. I don't have the energy for that. Um, we're going to see how our little spore babies are doing. Sorry, I will get to that. Um, no. Yeah, no. I'm sorry. Um, I'm not no, I'm not doing Freddy's right now. I... I so I'm going to be playing Five Nights at Freddy's Part 1. So I totally meant to do this well before Christmas, well before October even ended, but here we are in 2024, finally playing Five Nights at Freddy's. And before 2025, hopefully we get through all of them, but I don't know, we'll see from there. But hey, some things have changed. I got a green screen, testing that out, hopefully it works pretty well. And uh, yeah, just a couple little other doohickeys that we're going to mess around with in future videos. But for now. Let's try and get through Five Nights at Freddy's. For those of you who don't know, this is based off of Chuck E. Cheese. They had a little incident with like a kid putting their hand or their head or something in an animatronic's mouth and it closed on them. I don't think they died, but it's uh, definitely led to a cool little fan base of this game, which is cool. Sorry, I'm already terrified. Hello? Hello? Hello, hello. hello. Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact, so... Oh, wild. I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. So let's just focus on getting you through your first okay? Yeah, let's focus uh, let's on see. it. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. Uh, it's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Upon discovering that damage Especially or person. occurred, a missing person report will be filed within 90 days or as soon as property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters here do get a bit quirky at night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing, those same stupid songs for 20 years, and I never got a bath, I'd probably be a bit irritable at night, too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children, and we need to show them a little respect. Right? Okay. So just be aware, the characters do tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some Not kind of free but... roaming mode at night. Oh, they'll wander. Uh, something about their servos locking up, they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too, but then there was the bite of 87. Yeah. It's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now, concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, Sounds great. Now, that wouldn't be so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wires, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed in 
inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort. I forgot how and long then, the intro to this is. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth that pop out the front of the mask. You know? Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first station of the breeze. I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check why. those cameras and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Got to conserve power. Alright, good night. So I just didn't want to cut him off again, but uh... If they don't really use these guys often, like these animatronics, do you think maybe it would be time to maybe scrap them? You know, just scrap them. They cause so many issues and they're not really being used anymore. Then why not just scrap them? I, I never understood that. Anyway, this is Five Nights at Freddy's. This is the game. This is it. And that's it. You just keep an eye out kind of check around, see if anybody's moving or doing their thing. And when they do, you got the door, you got the lights, you got the cams, you got 69% power left. Oh, now it's not as funny. But, but, okay. But yeah, so that's pretty much it. That's the game. And uh, it's mortifying, believe it or not. If you have no experience with it, then get ready. It's just jump scare city. Music starting to get a little rough. But nobody's moved yet. It's already 3 a.m. We're halfway there. Is that cold? Oh, hi, buddy. Hi. They call you Foxy. You sure are. Damn, I wish I had a, like, a, like a Game Boy or some or something to interact with. Can I turn off this fan? Do I really need it? It's just wasting power. Those eyes, man. You can get lost in them. It was a fairly easy night one. I remember it being a lot harder my first go arounds. I gave this a little college try. Failed around this time, too. So, I'm really kind of confused why nobody's really... Ah! There you are. What's up, Bonnie? I guess four o'clock's your witching hour, huh? Let's give him a little time. He might be a little camera shy. Unless we don't want anything to happen too fast, right? Oh, and he's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Oh. Oh, he's close. Oh, what? <laughs> Guys? What was that? I don't... I don't remember a Golden Freddy. Huh. So, I don't know too much about this game. I did just look up what Golden Freddy is, and apparently she could just happen whenever. Apparently also Golden Freddy is a she. Pretty cool. Um, never heard of a female named Freddy. That's pretty badass. Um, is the original Freddy also a female? Like Frederica? But, like, nicknamed Freddy? something I've never known, if that's the truth. Anyway, I looked up uh, that you can just hide back by looking at the cams if Golden Freddy comes around. So that's good info to know. Okay, Bonnie is in cam 5 backstage. Freddy, leave me alone. Bonnie's chillin'. Bear and Chica are chillin'. Uh, 
Bonnie came out pretty early this night. Oh, the funny one. Fuckery. We are halfway there again. Bonnie's chilling like a good bunny in backstage. Doing their thing. You, know, you really like backstage, huh? As long as you stay there, that's fine by me. Four o'clock, four o'clock, probably not the best time for coffee, but oh well. <sighs> Bonnie, where you at? Still there? Hell yeah! Oh, I love this. Stay there, Bonnie. Not mean to do that, and that scared the crap out of me. It is a fairly chill night. We're only halfway to dead battery, though. I believe we're almost more than halfway done. Just, just about. 4 a.m. Where you at? There you are. Oh, now Chica's on the move, though. Got Chica and Bonnie. Fucking Boxy's chillin'. Chica's having old Din Din. Okay, 4 a.m. We got this. Oh, Chica. Chica? Okay, you know, you had something to eat, now you gotta take a poopy. That's fine. Bonnie, you being a good bunny. Okay. Uh, let's just close that door there. That's fine, right? Yeah. Where are you at? Where are you at, Chica? Bonnie's coming. Oh my god. Huh. Oh my god, please. Nope. Nope. Doors are staying closed till 6 a.m. Fuck all of you. If I finish the first night, I'm ending this video as a treat to myself. I'm just pointing that out. Okay. Okay. Chillin'. Oh. Okay, guys. 
that was the first night. And this thus begins. No. <laughs> no, we're not doing a second night. Thus begins the chronology of Five Nights at Freddy's. I hope you enjoy it. Maybe I will, at some point, be able to do multiple nights in one episode. Today is not that day, and I'm sorry. But I hope you enjoy this little taste, and I hope to see you back in the next one. So thank you, hope you have a great night, day, wherever you are, and I'll see you in the next one. Shut up, Shaggy! Yes.